Yeah. So last year you did uh, second place. Yeah. yeah. You, you lost in the final you lost against Santaraya. Yeah. So now we're gonna watch the fight in the blue judogi from Mongolia. Shimit Yonnen and in the white judogi from Russia, Galstian Azen. It's gonna be a good fight, what do you think? I think it's a good fight, but for me it's a little bit a surprise that Polpada is going to be in the semi-final. Okay. I was expecting Santaraya against Galstian, mm -hmm. but it did, it did fight very well today, mm -hmm. and so we will see what happened in the semi-final. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, and yeah, I just uh, looked, he won against uh, Santaraya in the quarter-final, the Mongolian. Yeah. Yeah. Both are very upright fighters, yeah? yeah. And I think that and looks really attractive. Normally both are left fighters. Okay. Oh. Mm. No, they gave nothing. We see it again. Moroto Seonage from the Russian. Mm. Yeah, it you could, could be. Yeah. It could be Yuko. Yes, it could be, yeah. Well, that's counter. Dalstian was took the bronze medal in the World Championship this year mm -hmm. in Tokyo. Ooh, yeah. Shimata attempt. Can be dangerous. Yeah. For sure against the Russian. <laughs> But both are trying to make the first score. Yeah. So the Mongolian uh, is seated on the world ranking list of number 22 and the Russian Galsian is number 7 in the world ranking list. We're both for waiting for the right moment. Both are trying to make the attack, but yeah. nothing happened yeah. until now. Oh, and so the Mongolian gets the first warning for being passive. But I think both try to throw and both try to do something. Maybe the Russian is a little bit more dominated. I think the Russian is more flexible than the Mongolian. Yeah. He's a, he's a very strong. He has a very strong grip. He's also very explosive uh, doing his attacks. Yeah. Have you ever uh, fight against I've the Mongolian? Fought against both. Okay. I won against the Mongolian in Hamburg. Yeah. I think 2008. And I lost against Galstian last year, uh, this year in the, in the Masters in January. Okay, yeah. So you know both very well. <laughs> and yeah, today in the semi final in six kilo, are just former Russian countries mm -hmm. like Mongolian, Russian, Russian, and Armenia. Yeah. One and a half minute to go now. Still no score. It's balanced. 
Dona Mongolian has, oh, he had a good grip. So, how big is your team here in Abu Dhabi? You are the only one for uh, who's fighting uh, for the men. No, no. From, from Austria? Yes. Uh, 160, 166, okay. 173, yeah. and 190. Okay. So, four boys and two girls. Okay. The Mongolian got the second Cheeto. Yeah. So, the Russian is leading by Yuko now. Yeah, so the first penalty, yeah. So. And I think now it's going to be very difficult for a Mongolian. To come back. To come and back. Maybe to, to get a Yuko, or, yeah, get a score. Yeah. I Normally the Russian is fighting very clever. Yeah. So I just want to say it. Yeah, he's experienced and if he's leading, he knows with what a to score, do now. Yeah. It's very hard. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Nice one. But no score. But also a good reaction from the Mongolian. Yeah. He turned in the right moment not to it's give the Russian a score. Half minute to go. Here we see it again. Oh, Kochigari. Nice one in the right minute. Yeah. Ooh. So, did they give a yuko now? A yuko from the for the Mongolian. Yeah. But I now think it's no yuko. Yeah, because uh, was the action was from the Russian, you know, and um, he attacked and. He was trying to do a makikomi. Yeah, and of course, for makikomi, you go to the ground, and maybe the referee thought that could be a counter for the. You see it again. Oh. These uh, situations are really strange. Yeah, you don't know. Give a score or don't give it. Le they let it. So. Oh. And sometimes it's also even hard for the referees. Yeah, yeah. They have just. A short time to watch it. Yeah. And uh, they, so. they don't have the possibility to see it again. Yeah, yeah, that's right. They have to react when they see it. They have to react in the right way. And sometimes it's really, really difficult to make the right decision. So now we see. So now we're going to the golden score. Yeah. I think a little advantage for the Russian. Oh, so they didn't get it. They didn't get it. <coughs> I didn't see it. Maybe they took this Yuko back. Maybe we will have a I don't know the, what happened now. But that's the only... The only reason for that, they took this Yuko back. So we